Hey guys, so on today's video, we are gonna do a coffee bar clear out. We're gonna get ready for fall decor. I'm hoping that most of the things fit in two bins because that's all I have. <laughs> I never know what to do up there. This little shelf. I'll eventually figure it out. These are the cups that I need to go through that need to be put away. These, and I'm a little sad because a lot of these are so fun and cute. I just need to remind myself that I have a lot of cute stuff for fall as well. So we'll see. We're going to get rid of these. We're going to put them on the side, put them in bins. And then a lot of drinkware here as well. Like all of that is mainly summer and springtime. I did do a reel on Instagram, so I do have this hung up, but it's not going to stay here, I don't think. At least not that way. In here, there's a lot of things that need to also be put away. And then in here too, I really need to clean those shelves and those glass panels because they look a little dirty. Let's do an iced coffee because it's iced coffee time and I'm craving one. Let's use Fredo Intenso. I'm gonna use two of these to make a, an ice latte. And it'll just be our regular salted caramel. So good, yummy, yummy. Okay, let's do it. All right, let's clear this coffee bar out of all these cups, you guys. I know I have so many cups. I I think for the new year, I have a new resolution. I wanna sell a lot of cups. I am attached to a lot of them, so I can't really promise how many I'm gonna sell, but I have way too many. They were everywhere in these cabinets, on the shelves, in this little island, so yeah trying to get rid of as much as I can that I'm not going to use for the season and I can tell you I got rid of a lot. My son is up so I'm gonna have to get to him. I think the next time I film, you guys might see me in a different outfit, but look at him, he's just waiting for me. If I decide to film tonight, I'll just be a little bit of a different lighting, but I'll catch you guys soon. All right, it is the next day, but we have to continue. We are gonna jump right into clearing the coffee bar, I'm trying to like just have a clean slate to start decorating. this machine I never know what to do with it I always feel like it should be here and something else should be here I don't know what do you guys think leave it in the comment section what should I do let me know should I put it on here I think for sure I want to leave this little area untouched I just feel like it just makes more sense to have the Ascaso machine here but with the Nespresso I just I don't know and I like the pot holder I just don't know if it's too much on this i think that's what's bothering me but we'll see and that's how the coffee bar looks empty i'm gonna wipe everything down and then we'll start decorating share with you guys two new things that I bought for the coffee bar this is the cutest little double tier tray two tier trays that we call it from Target so this is kind of like a ceramic thing and then the bottom is brass colored metal I got a frame because I actually got this printed for the coffee bar it's one of those things that you buy on Etsy so this is gonna go above where the Nespresso machine is. I think that's where I'm gonna put it. And I might get another print, but I'm still deciding on another one. This is a 16 by 20, but it looks like, you know, when you go to a restaurant and you order something <laughs> and it says pumpkin spice everything. Fall is my favorite in the guest check. 
who has started decorating i know it's a little early but i've always loved decorating early for you guys so that you can get some inspiration some ideas so yeah that's why i do it early otherwise i would probably start decorating in september let me know in the comments when would you start decorating are you decorating now or are you just watching this video for inspiration let me know I don't know why I'm so excited for this part, but this is my first time printing something out and I, it's not gonna be the last because it was so easy to print this like thing. And they have so many designs on Etsy that I'm excited for Christmas. This is a 16 by 20, like I mentioned earlier. I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna hang it up. I think I have like some command hooks for these, but it's, so this thing is called like a mat, but I'm going to take that off. So it'll be like a full frame um, for the art. So let's figure this out. I had every intention of doing this all by myself. I hung it up with the command hooks. And then my husband saw it and said, nope, I'm doing this for you. So he did it. I'm thankful because now I don't have to worry about the wall art falling overnight. His way is just a lot more secure. I'm exhausted but I'm happy with how it turned out so I'm gonna go through the whole coffee bar I kind of already gave you an overview I wanted to just talk about a few little things if I can link some stuff I will link them in the description box so let me show you so I already explained this is from Etsy and I will leave the link for this one down below as well as the frame I'm gonna do another video of like fall essentials as far as like syrups milks sauces but this is one of them I think this size is sold out for now. I hope it comes back, but they still have a lot of the smaller sizes available. And white chocolate, you just you just have to have the white chocolate. This little tray I got from Target last year in the dollar section. This is from At Home. These are from Home Goods, At Home. This cute little tray is from Target. I like that it comes out this way. So sometimes I feel like I don't have enough space to get my things. So that's kind of nice. These are all linked on my Amazon under coffee stuff. They're just like little, I think they call them bitter bottles. And that's where I put a lot of my syrups at. I have the white chocolate from Monin. It's not my favorite. That one's my favorite. That's why it's a humongous bottle. And then I have their chocolate. Tarani's caramel is the way to go for caramel sauce. And then all these mugs. These are from last year. This blue one is still available, I think, from Anthropology, But these are from last year my ember mug i love that it's like a rose gold it matches the season <laughs> over here i have a matcha bowl that i just got from an etsy seller and she is also on instagram so i'll make sure to put her link these are also from um a little small boutique on instagram i don't know if she has those i think i got the last ones honestly that is from anthropology but i will link similar ones because they have some really cute ones a lot of these are from anthropology these are last year so i can't link those i use a lot of my my things throughout the years like i don't like to buy everything new so that's the only thing the only drawback that a lot of the things will be sold out and then this is available from the house of daisies little bowl with all my tools and then up here is where i'm going to store the coffee grounds or the coffee beans a little bit of decor from target last year 
my Chemex. This side is where I have my manual coffee, Escaso machine. This is my knockbox Etsy seller. I'll make sure to link that. All of this for the most part is on my Amazon under espresso, but this is from Pesado brand. I will link them. I think they now have a US website because they are based out of Australia otherwise. And then all the pumpkin mugs on this side along with these little glass shot glasses super cute i'll link those those are from amazon and then just little pops of pink i like this is also from the same seller as the matcha bowl so i'll make sure to link that as well ignore my fridge i didn't organize that just because i ran out of time but that is pretty much how the coffee bar looks i absolutely love it let me know what you guys think in the comments below. This light is not flattering at all. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what was your favorite little section of the coffee bar. I cannot wait to share with you guys fall recipes, all the fall essentials for your coffee bar. So stay tuned for that. And if you are not subscribed to my channel, please, please, please subscribe if you just happen to stumble upon this video because you wanted to see a coffee bar decor, make sure to subscribe. And yeah, I think that is it. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.